Hello, everybody. I'm home. Oh, yeah, I'm finally so back cool. home. Oh, oh man, you guys don't know how long it's been for me trying to get back here. You don't know what an arduous journey it has been. I mean, I love Bob, and I'm so glad that I was able to visit him in DC. But my God, getting here has been a freaking nightmare. So. I'm home, yes. So I'm finally gonna be able to play No Man's Sky, which is a game that I've been looking forward to for a while, and I actually saw Bob play it, uh, back when I was over visiting him, and, and we got it like, it was like midnight during the launch date, and we just opened it up, and it was just like... <gasps> Oh, it's so cool! <laughs> so, like, this whole game is just gonna be me going, Oh, it's so cool! <laughs> so, yeah, I look forward to a lot of that. That's gonna happen. So, anyway, I have not played it for myself, but I got a basic understanding of it because what I gathered from uh, Bob here. And what you're gonna see here is my kind of unedited journey into the world of No Man's Sky. And the point of No Man's Sky, if I had to, like, glean any sort of meaning from what it is, uh, the point is to represent, like, the feeling, the, the immense, like, unimaginable magnitude of the cosmos. Like, I, I don't know, I haven't read any reviews about the game, I haven't really read up on any of the meta of the game or the lore of the game or anything like that, but just from what I saw from Bob's playing, it's about this gloriously huge, immensely enormous universe with which you are dropped into, procedurally generated from start to finish. Okay. I'm on Fageso, Nick. It sounds like the Space Corps. Oh. I'm so excited. <laughs> oh, man. Repair required? Okay. So I got the basic premise of the beginning of this game. Uh, okay. Thank you. I got a jetpack. So what I'm going to be showing you guys is kind of... Okay, good. At least we have that. So basically, you're stranded on a planet. Okay. Planet. Fegeso! Neek is dick! <laughs> is dick! Good thing I'm on planet is dick, or else I wouldn't have a good time while I'm here. But you're stranded on a planet, and you have to use your, like, multi-tool to try to find your way back into space. Which is the first objective, and probably what I'm gonna do in this episode here, but... Right here, is something very interesting. Cuz... Reality seems to fold in on itself. One moment I can see debris in another vast red orb, almost too large and too bright to behold. It knows me inside and out more than I could ever know myself. Could this be the face of creation itself? Or in my hazy, freshly awakened state am I being manipulated? A name burns itself into my mind, Atlas, and a request made without words that I should follow the path this being, this Atlas, has set for me. You know, uh, what's interesting about this is Bob chose to spurn the direction and explore freely, which would be totally fine, but from what I've gathered, there is an idea that there's something at the center of the universe, and I believe this thing will set you on a path to go there, and that's kind of what I want. I don't know even know if I'm ever going to get to the center of the universe. I don't even know if that's a thing that's possible, because the universe in this game is so unbelievably big, much like our universe is so unfathomably big, that I kind of want to accept its guidance for now. Or not. There we go. I feel suffused with the warm glow of approval. I was lost, but am found. The Atlas acknowledges my allegiance. Oh shit, did I just allegiance myself to something? Okay, so whatever that did, I'm not 100% sure, but it sets you on a path that might be going to the center of the universe. And so, you have your laser here. Blam! And you just gotta destroy the planet to gather crap, uh, like carbon and stuff that you need to be able to get back home. And you use these base things uh, for iron and such, such as you get the things that you need and your mining laser can overheat. Oh, find your crashed starship. Well, I know where my crashed starship is. It's right there. How can anyone... Oh, shit, my scanner's damaged. How can anyone uh, miss it? Can I run? Whoa. What was that? Oh, okay. All right, then. Hello, Razamama. All right. 
Thrusters critically damaged. Vital launch and landing gear system. Okay. So I need to get enough materials to be able to repair these things. For this, you need four karite sheets, uh, which you craft here. But I don't have enough because they require more iron. So basically, the beginning phase of this is just going to be a lot of uh, gathering materials and also exploring this planet. Because this planet is completely unique to every other planet in the universe. Or maybe not completely unique, you might find similar planets. But everything is procedurally generated, right down to the plants, right down to the animals. It's like the Spore Creature Creator. There's worlds out there that have horrifying dick monsters. I guarantee it. I'm like that guy from Men's Warehouse. I guarantee there's some planets, or many planets, with dick monsters of complete varying size, shape, and girth. So if you want to look forward to something like that, then that's what you get. Also, I need zinc and iridium. There's a bunch of stuff that I need, and I'm going to go get it eventually. But for right now, I'm just going to explore uh, the baser things here. So there's, like, cargo drops that you can get. Oh. I don't know what that is. I don't know why that is. Atlas Pass. I don't know what that is either. Okay, nothing found. Well, thank you for that. Ah, plutonium. Good. Exactly what I needed. Nothing! Great! I'm so glad these useful drops were put here for me. Okay, that's broken. Okay, what is this? Deflection Enhancement Tau? Okay! For the starship. Okay. Man, that needs a lot of materials. I don't have any of that, but there's something over here. How do I run? Woo. Please tell me that wasn't run. Okay, whatever. Okay. Some people were probably upset that I didn't complete the job on that one. You've learned the Viking word for interloper. Now, the Viking thing is interesting. The Viking thing, not Viking thing. And also, the plants have the silicate stuff and all that jazz. God damn it. Is the field of view, like, turned up really high? Am I zoomed in on something? Or am I just looking really closely to everything on the screen? I don't know. It seems like everything's a lot closer than it was. Hey! Okay, so that's nothing. How about this? Yeah. I don't have a scanner yet. I need to get enough materials to be able to scan something. But that comes later. Yeah. Yeah. I'm just gonna zap everything on the planet. Eventually I'll get down to the core and blow up the entire existence of wherever the hell we are on Is Dick. Planet Is Dick. Okay. Hello! Hi! Who are you? Can I help you? Are you a friend? Uh... Okay, bye. Thank you. Did you just sterilize me or something? Did you shoot me with gamma lasers? lasers? Okay, torch. Okay, so there's... Uh, let's see. How do I repair things? Options? No! Oh, waypoints discovered. I don't know. I don't know. Oh, man. See, I'm in a system, too. Like, I'm in a, si like a solar system. So, my specific star has a certain number of planets in him. So, there may be other planets in the system, but I won't know that until I get up to the space, which I'm so eager to do, because it's so cool! Now, I don't know about the longevity of this game, but right now, it's so cool! Ah! I can't imagine it! I'm sorry. I'm not even in space yet, and I'm freaking out about it. It's just, like, I know that there's a lot of games that are going to be coming out that are supposed to be like this in recent space. There's, like, this one... Ah, oh, man, I forget the names of them. I'm, I'm terrible with names. But there's a couple games that are supposed to be about space exploration and all that stuff. And this is the first one that has come out thus far. Uh, but there's more on the way. And I don't know what each of them is going to be, but the fact that there's more space games coming out is just... Oh... It tickles my soul. <laughs> it just, oh, I want to go to space so badly. <laughs> All right, but I'll be there in a second. Also, um, okay, so I think I have enough to be able to... Oh. I'm sorry. Can I help you? What are you doing? Okay, so I need to... How the frick do I... What is... Can you go away, please? Okay. That's not it. That Oh, here we go. Controls. That's what I need. Okay, so... Move, run, switch weapon mode, discoveries, inventories. That's right. I need to press on the big doodaddy button. So, yeah. Boink. Alright, that's what I needed. So, I need to go to my exosuit, and I need to repair... Exosuit? No, my tool. I need to repair this, which I have. There we go. So now I got my, my scanner and my analysis visor. So the analysis visor is, is what's going to help me, uh... Ooh. No? 
Oh. It's what's gonna help me scan different things in the environment. Ah, oh, there we go. What is that? Yes! Yes! Abilum! Aurelitism! Okay, cool. I don't know what that do. Ooh, boink! Eau de Forterra! Cigaretum! Oh, <laughs> then you just analyze things! Come for ya! Come for ya! Oh, okay, sure. I'm okay with that. Oh, man. Oh, why is the screen like cut off on the sides for me? I think I think what's wrong is oh That's why cuz I was zoomed in never mind. I'm freaking out about absolutely nothing over here. Yeah I need your delicious carbon Excuse you The hell was that There's also aminals on these planets on the planets that are capable Hello? Burbs? On the planets that are capable of of... Cool, Thamium-9. On the planets that are capable of uh, harvesting life, there are animals and they're all procedurally generated. I don't think I'd be lucky enough to spawn on the... Holy shit! Good god, what is going on out there? Ugh. Okay. Also, yeah, that's how you launch. Oh, I don't think there's any running, but there's definitely uh, some stuff here. Did I get? Oh, I already gathered these. Okay, so what I need to do is I need I need to go out and I need to go find more rare minerals. And there's some stop moaning in my ear. Why did I have to get the planet of the moans? Just everyone's moaning about planet is dick. All right. Ugh. So anyway. Oh, wait, hang on. I need to scan this. How do I scan? There we go. Ooh, look at you. Why do you move? Hizoni! Gipsurag. Eee! Sorry, buddy. You seemed like you could move, which probably meant that you were some sort of intelligent, but not intelligent enough to get away from my laser. And also, my mining beam is almost out of charge, so what I need to do is I need to zip zap my zippy. Okay. The hell is going- What are you doing? What are you? I'm gonna scan you. Are you something that I should blow up? I mean, Bob blew it up, but this one doesn't seem to be attacking me very much. So I'm just gonna operate under the assumption that you're peaceful, and that everything is totally fine. Okay, so over here, I saw something. No? Oh man, apparently not. Oh god, this is gonna take forever to destroy. I'll go after the easier targets. I don't like these, like these small cactus-like things that just blow up. I hate the way they shake before they blow up. <laughs> no, please! Oh, God! And then, kaboom, and then you're gone forever. Oh, jeez. Hello. What is you? Analyzing. Ofo- o o foam I think they're just making shit up now. I'm pretty sure- I don't know what the intelligence for- Hello! What are you? Oh! Jun- Oh, its temperament is shy! Come back here, Junopli Gofelnot! Oh, you're so cute! Don't run from me! Even though I'm a big, terrifying monster- Look at you! Oh! Oh, look at you! Oh, you're so cute! Oh, I'm gonna name you- Just give me a second, I need to name you. I need to name you, like, individually, because when you discover things because everything's randomly generation, you have the right to name them. Which is kind of cool. Wow, it is cold as shit. How did it get so cold? And what the hell am I supposed to do about that? Can I do anything about it being cold? Okay, so these big- for some reason there's just big piles of gold out on the surface. I don't know why. I don't know why there would be. Man, but why is it so- Night here is terrifying. Apparently. God damn it, what's with- there- there must be more animals searching around, but I don't have time to let it bother me. I gotta get this gold and I gotta get going. Cause you gotta get materials of all sorts to be able to do the things that you need to do and pretty much everything can be destroyed. And I don't know- like, I don't know what kind of planet I would land on where there'd just be a giant stack of gold jutting out from the ground in my fir- My first instinct is just to blast it with a laser away. 
But then again, I don't know what sort of international economy is going on here. Because the Viking, once we get into space, you'll see. Like, me and me and Bob, when we were first jettisoning into space, like, I didn't see much past that, but it was just, Oh! Oh my god! And then there were play- there were, uh, there were ships up there. And then, then he died. And it was just really stupid because he picked a fight with someone that he shouldn't have picked a fight with. And that was his fault because he's dumb. And also not very smart. But me, I'm equally as dumb. So I imagine I'm gonna make similar mistakes and good god, it's go- Whoa! What are you? Ooh, hello. Ooh. Abject Gothelnaut? That's a good name for you. Congratulations on being well named first off. I don't have to kill you now. Oh, hello. Ah, ooh, what is that? Ooh, there's something down there. <gasps> is it like a cargo deposit? Something like that? Ow, my ankles! <laughs> Why did that happen? I guess you're not supposed to fall from great height. Is that plutonium? I think so, yeah. Okay, so what do we got here? Way to where to go. Oh. Well, okay. Oh, aluminum. Oh, that's cool. I didn't even see aluminum on Bob's planet. What? Oh, yeah. Uh, once your inventory gets full, you need to send stuff back off to uh, to the ship. So you don't go too far away from the ship, and then you just send up uh, like that's full. The gold. I'm not gonna get any more of that. Okay. Huh. Aluminum. Weird. Yeah. This doesn't seem like a fun place. Ooh, what's with the glowy? Is that important or is that just randomly? Oh man, there's so many things that I don't know about this game. There's so many cool things that I don't know. It's so cool. <laughs> Alright, anyway, I'm sorry. I, I'm, I'm gonna try to leave this relatively, like, relatively uncut. Temperature level stabilizing, why? Is it getting day? A Ooh, nice. Nice. I'm gonna try to leave this generally uncut because I kind of like the idea of a non-stop adventure that you guys are joining me on. Because you're all learning this stuff as I'm going through it. I mean, the game, like, from a basic principle is basically the same between players, but for me and my experience, no one's ever seen this planet before. I mean, that's kind of like what reality is. Up there, those planets may not be very different from ours, and maybe the flora and fauna generally fits like the same stereotypes that we have here. But at the same time, it's all new! Kukle! Kukle Bigatactera! Oh! You're amazing. What is you? What are you, you little rock? Oh, Oodlamite. Cool! I guess? Awesome! Oh, I can't destroy you. But yeah, so it, it's just a sense of exploration as you go around in the world and- Oh, I didn't even see that mountain up there. Oh, that's awesome. Oh, hello! Hi! How are you? I'm gonna join you soon, don't worry about that! I'll be with you in just a moment. Oh. oh. Did I get you? I don't know if I got you. Yeah, you're new. Haboom! Rukergum Hanachi. Whatever the hell that means, whatever the hell you are. Oh, you're a shield floor, okay. Did I scan you? Okay, I already got that one. So, basically, that that's what it is. But we'll get to more in just a second. I'm gonna get to my starship because I might have enough to repair it. I'm not 100% sure. I believe I, I still need more stuff, but... Also, I believe I can upgrade my uh, mining laser if I get... Like, if I uh, actually install technology. Ah, no. I need titanium. I think I get titanium from actually breaking down those, uh, drones that are flying around. But I need to actually combat them, which I'm not particularly competent- Oh, hello! You just walked in front of me! That was- you, that, you, that was your fault! I didn't do that! You walked right in front of my beam! Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. Ah! Come on, come on, come on, there we go. One down. Titanium, thank you. See, it wasn't my fault, he just- He literally stepped in front of me! He provoked me! This is self-defense at this point! Hey, yabba dabba yabba yabba. Okay, there we go. All right. Well, that solves our titanium problem that we had. I guess we don't need to worry about that anymore. Sentinel force deactivated. I'm the best. I did it. I killed them dead. Hooray! Murder! Good! Okay. So now, we need to- Oh, journey milestone complete. What did I do? Your first murder! You did it! Okay, good! Yep, that's basically what that was. 
Oh, that's so nice. It's so nice. Oh, what is with that obelisk looking thing? Ooh. There's a lot of noises going on. Also, that's a rather phallic assembly of gold over there. I'll get back. I'm gonna make my way back to the ship now. I'm pretty sure I have enough. Let me just get this iron and then I'll be good. Yeah, because I got enough for the karite sheets, I imagine I do anyway. So I'm pretty sure I'm gonna be able to get all that I need to go. Man! The moans are picking up! Like a lot! Hit. Oh, that's so cool! Ow! Damn it. Why do I keep doing that? You'd think that I'd learn. I don't know, it's my first time playing, so maybe give me a give me a darn chance. Ah, here we go. Shield. Eh. There we go, your shielding increases. So, you have shields- Oh, hello. Farms of plutonium? Why is there plutonium just in shards on the ground? Man, if that was available here on Earth, boy howdy, we'd have a rough time of things. Alright. And don't worry, I'm gonna go over to those, um... I'm gonna go over to the, uh, the question mark very soon. That's gonna be next on my list, but I wanna make sure that I get my, uh... My shield up in order, or my, uh, my, uh, ship up in order first. And if I can't get my ship up in order, uh, in this, in this one trip, then I'm just gonna walk over there. Ah, that's gonna be good. Oh, also, it tells you, like, estimated time of arrival for how far away you are from things. Oh, hello. What are you over here? I don't have an Atlas Pass! I can't do that yet! Okay. So now we hop in here. Okay, launch thruster critically damaged. Well, let me do something about that. Because I can make karite sheets... Like thusly. Yep. E uh, uh, yeah. Okay. So now that I have that, I can repair this. Bam! Okay. Pulse engine. Boost on demand pulse jumps. Thamium 9 is required. I don't have any heridium, but I might. If the launch thruster is ready, I might have enough that I can just go around? Can I. Can I fly? Ah, uh, damn it. Okay, so I need the pulse engine to be able to do that, even though I got the launch engine. So I need heridium, which is somewhere. I believe it's on a plant, but I'm not entirely sure. So I need to go get that. But at least I got my save point. So what I'm gonna do next is I'm gonna go for... I believe actually that big obelisk is made of some material, but I don't know if it's exactly what I need just yet. It's probably these blue icons, because isn't wasn't that like the first thing that I got was heridium? Oh, and let me, uh, yeah, it is, because it marks it on my, uh, it marks it on my notification doodad. So let me transfer this, transfer the aluminium, that, uh, the zinc, I guess, can go. Need the carbon, uh, need to charge my lice for the port, because otherwise I'll die dead. Okay, so that should be fine. All right, so these, thankfully, are marking down where I need to go for the materials. And, I, and I've been told also, oh, that's platinum. Oh, well, that's not what I need. I need heridium. So I've been told that. Ow! Son of a bitch! Oh, so you're you're just avenging your friend's death here. God damn it! Stop that! I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you. Oh, you're protected by the invulnerable plan. Oh, you're smart. Oh, you think you're so great. Well, too bad for you. Okay, so wait. I see on my icon. Ah, here we go. There's a different blue. Okay, so I'm gonna go for the Heridium, and I'm- I'm pretty sure- I'm pretty sure that big block of something is a big block of something that I'm gonna need. I'm not 100% sure, but- Whoa! Hey guys! How you doing? It'd be bad if I shot at you, whoa. I thought they were gonna stop for a second there. I guess I'm not too terribly important to be able to do that. Okay. Right, but- Two minutes! Two minutes?! God damn it. Well, how can I get there faster? My jetpack doesn't exactly make me go fast. I'm trying. Oh, jeez, it's so far away. Well, what about this big thing? Wait, this is Heridium! I, I knew it! I knew this was a thing! Man, the, the game's trying to throw me off and tell me that I don't know what I'm doing when exactly I do know exactly what I do. Alright. Alright. So there's plenty of Heridium. Why was it trying to make me go somewhere else? Alright, so with this Heridium, though, I should have enough to be able to repair the boosters on my ship and then be able to use my ship to go to other places on the planet, which is gonna be a lot more beneficial than just walking there, because that's what I was gonna originally set out myself to do. But now, I don't have to! Hooray! Hooray for laziness! And the advent of technology in our lives. Oh man, so cool. So cool. 
Yeah, see, I, I actually, I need to look up and actually understand where other people are in terms of this game and what they have done thus far. Because, honestly, I, I kind of wonder if anyone's actually made any sort of significant progress on making it to the center of the universe. Because where you spawn in is supposedly pretty random, but I bet they're willing, I'm willing to bet that everyone is probably set, like, a certain distance away from the main goal. A and what's even weirder is that like, I, okay, I don't know a lot, so I'm speaking a lot out of my ass, but from what I've heard, or what I imagine, we start out and we, we're just moving through our own solar system first, and then you jump to the galactic view, but the thing is, as many stars as there are in the sky, there's galaxies too. Not an equal number, of course, but there's still billions of galaxies. Galaxies and galaxies are enormous and getting to anywhere in this huge big universe with just our piddly tiny itty bitty little starship it's Like the tiniest little thing and We're able to go across the universe. Ah, oh, it's so cool. I mean it might get boring after a while, but who knows? Ah, oh, it's so cool. Oh man. Ah, oh, but anyway, so I should have enough now uh, to repair my ship and then be able to use that, and this is gonna be- This is not gonna go well, because I, I imagine I'm gonna crash my ship many times, because I'm not exactly, uh, good at navigating anything. Okay, so we need two more Kerite sheets, which I have right here, and right here, and then I should be able to repair this, and I have some Thamium-9. Ooh, I got it! Okay, so let me just charge up the launch thrusters a little more. Okay, so... I did refuel the launch thrusters. I- I did! What? I- I did! I did! I refueled them! Do I need to refuel them all the way? Ah. Uh, yeah, it won't let me go. I need- I need to get more plutonium. Oh, that's such a cock! Alright, whatever. So, plutonium, I believe, is these, uh... No, that's not plutonium. That's thamium. Oh, maybe, maybe it is. Maybe it's gonna let me. Ooh, is it gonna let me? <gasps> Yay! But can I fly yet, is the question. I don't think it's gonna let me fly, but I did repair it. Oh, it did! Yeah! Okay, go. Don't drop me. Don't drop me. Uh, eh! Okay, we're fine. Oh, we're gonna be able to fly. It just didn't register it right away. Which is totally fine, I guess. Understandable. I'm... How do I? <laughs> How do I do this? I don't know. I'm holding R2. Wow! Oh, okay! Oh, no! Oh! Oh, that's so cool! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm really, uh, I'm real. whoa. That was a lot of scannage. Okay, so I'm gonna go towards that weird thing, and I believe... <laughs> We're not gonna go out of the atmosphere just yet. I wanna fuel my uh, ship up all the way and get some more materials before I actually go out of the atmosphere. But I need to find out what this thing is. How do I land? Oh, I don't know how to land. I don't know how to land. I don't know how to land. Initiate the landing sequence. Okay! Schwabooski. Bam, baby! Oh, it's so cool. Octav Desert. Hello! Hi, buddy! Don't worry, I'm not gonna hurt you. You're so dang dumb adorable. Oh, you're so ding dang dumb adorable. Okay. I, I will name my stuff at the end of the episode because I wanna- I wanna do all that. Whoa! What are you? Yeah! I got the Octav Desert! Nice! Okay, so supposedly there's gonna be some drops here. Health restorative. Ooh, what was that? I saw something! There was something over there! Something with, to do with zinc. Alright, whatever. Ooh, here we go. Alright, gimme... Ah, that's what I needed, plutonium. Okay. So that's a good amount of plutonium. Then I'm gonna gather up some more base iron. And then I should be good to go. Eventually, though, eventually I'm gonna need to upgrade my mining laser. What is you? What are you? G goopy! Goopo! Punimum to minimum! Okay, all right then. So down here, is there anything? No. 
So let me just get the rest of this stuff and find- Ah, that's a big plutonium deposit over there. Okay, I'm gonna get that. I, I know that, like, the majority of this game could just be me like, Ooh, what's that? Ooh, look at the shiny over there. Ooh, I'm gonna go over here. Ooh, guys, wait, I'm gonna do something. But, you know, it's just- it's just it's so cool. Oh, it's, it's so cool. Where'd it go? There it is. Yeah! Hello. Hi, friend. Thank you for all the plutonium. You are very delightful. Whoa! Hey! Can I have your titanium? Thank you! Oh, I'm bad at aiming with this. Man, I haven't played console games in a while, so I apologize for my terrible aim. It's- it's- this game doesn't come out for PC for a little bit. And I've heard that when it does come out for PC, it's gonna have a graphical update. Uh, because the PlayStation, like, it had limitations, not based on the PlayStation capability, but because there's so much data, that, like, I believe the PC has... I don't know. Something about that, but I believe it's gonna be more highly detailed on the PC. Whoa, what is that? Whoa! Debris! Debris! Come back here! Where are you going? Where are you going? Open it. Ooh. <gasps> neutrino module. I didn't even know that they dropped debris. That's kinda cool. So where was the other debris? Uh, I probably lost it because it's probably drifted away. Rolled downhill or something. Yeah, I probably rolled away. Oh uh, man, if I'd have known that, I would have been searching for it. Okay, I'll keep an eye out from now on for that stuff. Ooh, hello. Hey, big mama. Floating off the ground. Wait, is that you? No, you're not the- you're the same one I was just looking at. Okay, so... Alright, whoa. More? I'll take more. I need titanium. Hey, Dad, approaching. I'm trying to actually manage my heat. Because I'm not very good about that. Did I get them all? Nice. 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 Okay. So there's probably more plutonium over there. Might as well go get it. Because I believe... Um... No, actually, I'm good. The only thing I need, actually, is carbon. Holy shit, I'm low on carbon. I didn't even realize that. Because I get my, gotta get my life support systems up and running again. That'll do. A little more, a little more. A little more, please. Whoa, milestone! What did I do? Something amazing? I know, it's just because I'm so incredible. Oh! Well, that was slightly delayed, but I'll take it. Do I need to destroy- ah, that'd take too long. Alright, so, that's the scanner? Well, I know that! Is I doing something else about that? Ooh, hello. Terrible aim, terrible aim, terrible aim is the name of the game. Why do I gotta destroy the iron to get to that? Damn it. Can I melee it? Eh. There we go. Got it. What? No free slots. Huh. Alrighty then. Fosse Eorlegum. So I need to transfer stuff out. Uh so plutonium is actually full, so I can just transfer that. And the neutrino module, whatever the hell that is, I don't even know. What is this big bad mamma damma? Okay, can't do anything about that. Ah, I fell in a hole! Ah, I fell in more hole! Okay, hang on. Ah. Is there a way to turn up, like, the... Is there a way to turn up the, uh, field of view? Because... Move, look, flight, no. Field of view, no. Okay, so there's no way to turn up the field of view, so... It is, it is quite narrow. Okay, so save there. And now... Supposedly... It should be time to leave the planet! Which is gonna be super cool! I bet! Sorry, strange aminals of this planet! I'm out of here, baby! Okay, so... Hey. Ah! Nice. Okay, so I gotta refuel my thruster first. Uh, don't mind as I just drift off into space. Thamium 9. Okay, so that's some good chargeage. Oh, it's so cool. What is that? Ooh, what's that over there? There's something down there. It's like a red beacon type device. And let me land there first before I, I, I leave. It's gonna be quick, just a quick stop, and then I'm gonna be out of here. <laughs> nice. 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 Hello. Hi. Oh, oh. Aminal? Alright, whatever. Cool. Bypass chip. Oh, I can craft that. That's something I can craft. Hang on. Not there. Craft here. Uh, whoa. Stamina enhancement? I didn't know I could run! Well, okay! 
Oh! I didn't know I could do that! Alright then, but I'm gonna make a bypass ship, because I can use it on this. Yeah! Oh, this is the thing! Bob did this! It's so- Oh! So I don't need to look for a colonial outpost, because this is that. A monolith? I'll look up a monolith! Let's do that! There's noises! Ancient alien artifacts, huh? Ooh! Nice! It's a plaque! So that might teach me more words, which is kind of important in this whole deal. But this is an outpost. And I'm not 100% sure, but I believe... Ah! Hello! Hi! Ooh! Cool! Cool! Faster mining, that's awesome. Nice. Anything else in here? No? Okay. That's awesome! Okay, so if I do that... I don't even know how to run! How do I run? Oh... Okay. Let's do that! Can I do both of them? I can do both of them! Ooh, bolt caster. Targeted entity death. Well, I don't quite need that just yet, so let me do the, uh... Let me do the, uh, the intensifier. Because that's probably going to be a little bit better. Phase beam! Nice! I need more thamium! I don't have enough thame! Ooh, what are you? First aid? Don't really need that. I haven't been hurt that much. Whoa! Your standing with the Viking has increased! Cool, I guess! Alright, sorry, this, this short stop turned into a longer stop because now we gotta go to the monolith, but... It, it, it's important! Uh, that is important! And then we're gonna go into space! Uh, trust me, I'm just as eager as you guys are, and hello, weird... flat-tailed monstrosity. How do I...? There you are. Oh, you're so cute and horrifying! Docile, grazing creature, nice! Good thing I haven't run into any horrifying creatures. Oh, there's Thamium over there. Ah, whatever. Forget it. We gotta go. We gotta do things. Whoa, whoa. We're a little drunk. It's okay. Boof. Faster, 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 faster. Alright. A little faster. A little faster. Alright. Here we go, here we go. Three, two, one. Land! Uh, I hope this is a good landing spot. Doesn't look it, but okay, we'll take it. Alright. So now... So how do I run? Hang on, I gotta look up the controls for running. Run, 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 run. R3 down? R3 down? Oh, that's run? Well, that seems annoying. Ooh, here we go. Ah, nice! Nice. Ashes of the Islagimp! The imprint of an ancient civilization was once absorbed by this strange monster- marker. The story of the Vikings somehow spills out in the language of my own people. The noble travelers will be spared. Their journey through the cosmos shall not be thwarted. So it is decreed. The will of Herc commands it. The Viking shall honor the judgment, the belief of the agents. Ancients. Seek help with language. Yeah! My knowledge of the Viking increases! Learn to word for visual! Cool! So, that's another thing about this game. You gotta learn the entire language of the Viking to be able to understand most of it. And I don't know how much I'm gonna- Woo! Hey, little buddy, don't worry, I'm not gonna hurt you. I don't know how much of that I'm gonna be able to understand. And let me just see if there's any Thamium nearby. Is there? Is there? Hmm, it might be. Because the, uh... The electrical bolts might be that, but I don't have time for that. I've- I've put it off long enough. We're going to space, baby! We're going to baby space! Baby space is in baby's first solar system. So that I don't have to deal with being terrible too much longer. Oh, Fly up to exit atmosphere. Oh, we're going for it. Oh, we're going for it. Oh! Oh! Yeah! Woo! Hold- oh, engage boost. Oh! Yeah! Oh, yeah! Oh, it's so cool! Oh god, I gotta watch out for the rocks. Ah! Ah, rocks! Ah! No! Oh god! Oh, shit. Oh, god damn it. <laughs> but there it is. There's my baby! There's my baby's planet. Oh, baby's first planet. Oh, it's 
that's awesome! There's babies for a star! Ah! I shouldn't stare directly into it! Oh, man! I'm sorry. I <laughs> need a moment in there. There's the, uh... These are the guys that Bob picked to fight with. Like an idiot. I don't know why, but he did. Oh. Acquire hyperdrive technology, build hyperdrive, and then leave the system. So I don't know how to do any of that. And I've still got time left in the episode! Cause I'm gonna do this for a long time! Yeah! Oh man, I love it. Oh, I love it. You know, I don't even care if this game is good in the long run. The fact that this game can make me feel that feeling of just immense wow. Of just, oh, of just, Mwah. okay, so what is, what is on my market? What is that? What's that gonna go to? Space station? Hell yeah! Wow! Oh! oh my god. Oh, that's so awesome. 20 minutes? Hold, oh, pulse jump? Pulse jump? I don't know what the pulse jump is, but here we go. Engaging pulse drive. Woo! Woo! Holy sh- Oh, hi! Where'd that planet come from? Oh my god. And what's even more amazing is that everything in this solar system is unexplored. It's all gonna be explored for the first time by me. By me! Oh my god, do I have to hold this down? I'm holding down everything. Woo! Oh, that's so awesome. Look at the planets! Oh, yeah! So the space station is, um... It's made by, I believe, the Viking. It's by an NPC race, so it's not player-controlled or anything like that. All the players do is explore and document, because when the developers made this, I doubt they even know, like, what everything is. They just trust that everything is built well. I don't know. <laughs> How would I know? Oh, it's so cool. Okay, I should- I should slow down. I should- I should slow- I should- ah! Oh, oh, fuck. Ah! 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 Uh, can I- What is happening? Whoa! I don't think that was supposed to happen! Well! Oogie doogie then! I did not mean to do that. This is weird. So, okay. I'm gonna go. So, that was bizarre. <laughs> well, I'm gonna assume that that's just one of the perils of warp drive technology. Hello. Nice. Yeah, yeah, that's nice. Ooh, is that an entrance? That one of them entrance things? I'm going in! Fly me in, baby! I'm going in! Ah! Ooh, is it guiding me? It better be guiding me because I don't know what the hell I'm doing. Oh, that's awesome. Yeah! Yeah! <laughs> I'm such a loser. Oh, man. Oh. Welcome to the space station. Oh man, I love it. I love it. Love it, love it, love it, love it. Okay, so I'm gonna run in here real quick because uh, Bob showed me this. This is um, like a depot with these people. And these people are here and they're a little uh, ugly. You're horrifyingly ugly. So, this is Officer Ulonk, a be a Dexoy interloper. So, they don't like you in the beginning. They definitely don't like you, uh, but I'm gonna give them some things. The warrior's nostrils flare as I approach. It inhales deeply and barks out what could be a warning. I hurriedly mime that I'm peaceful and know little of its language. It takes a second to think, then suddenly grabs my multi-tool while barking again into my visor, streaking it with saliva. It's pointing at the indicator, which shows elements I carry. Okay. Have some of this. Yeah! Okay, teaching me some of its language. Ah, detection. Reload accelerant. Good, I can kill your drones more. Okay. How about? Okay. Gave him more carbon. So, what do you want now? 
I don't know those words. The warrior's hackles rise, and it starts to shake in anticipation of my request. I sense that its ancestors are likely to be offended if I push the in issue too far. Request new word. Well, I don't think I'm any of those things yet, so I'm gonna leave. You gave me some new technology, which is awfully nice of you. Uh, and then I'm gonna go, unless there's something on the other side, because I did not go to the other side. Ooh. Yeah, so, um, other NPCs are here too. These aren't players. I don't even know if this game can have you have the ability to interact with players. Not even that you would be able to in the first place. This universe is so big that the chances of two players, as many players as there are right now, interacting are unbelievably slim. Okay, so that's locked. So I can't go there anyway. Yeah. Okay, time to get out of here because we're gonna go to this new planet. We're gonna see what it's all about. Because this is gonna be good. Uh, how do we go? How do we go? I wanna. I'm holding R2. Oh, there we go. Hobuski! Oh, jeez. Oh, so I need to go to that beacon. Oh. What about this planet? What about this planet? Do I have to go to the beacon? I guess it'd be prudent. Yeah, why not? All right, this will be the last thing I do in this episode. I'm gonna go to this beacon. Booski! Wow, that's a lot. Okay, I am going to slow down much sooner now. Three, five, four, three, two. Let, let go. Stop. Stop. Okay. Okay. That's a little better. But the beacon is on the planet, or is it above the planet? Is it above the planet? I can't exactly tell. Beacon transmission detected. Huh. Oh, it's on the planet. Okay, it's on the planet. Okay. All right. So I'm gonna do a very stupid move. I'm gonna engage the pulse drive. Ah! Oh, fucking goddammit! <laughs> <laughs> I, I said, I said I was gonna do something very stupid, and then I was startled by my own stupidity. <laughs> so yeah, that was very dumb. I kind of want to do it again. That'd be cool. Okay. Oh, look at this. Oh, look at this. Oh, look at this. Not that you can look at anything else. Ooh, hang on. But there's something down there! Alright, fine, I'll be there in a second. It's not too far away from this beacon. I'm gonna go to the beacon. Cause I'm a good- I'm a good little boy that does what I'm told! Yay! Okay, we're almost there. Haboof! Okay, three, two, and landing! Nice! Nailed it! Nailed it! And there's something over there! I don't know what, but it's a thing. Oh! Damp, low security, rich, and sporadic fauna. Okay, but the floor is what I wanted anyway, so. Hey! Up! Oh. Whoa. What? I don't know what that means! Hello! Ah! Kooky! So, is there gonna be something over there? I don't have an Atlas Pass! Do I craft that? Where the heck is it? We've officially reached the limitation of all my knowledge, so I can't craft it. So what do I do with it? Yeah, what do I do with it? And how do I increase the storage capability of my dang ship? Because I'm about to run into spatial limitations. Oh. Yeah, if I had Atlas... Ooh. No, I can't do that. I need Atlas. I imagine maybe the Atlas Pass is something that you get from getting your reputation up with the other dudes. Oh, I forgot everything here is new! I can explore everything! Yeah! I don't know what you are, but I'm gonna look at you till I know. Yeah! Oh man, look at those jutting rock formations. Definitely something worth- Ooh, Yadronzonite. Nice. Yeah. Hello, tree. That looks like a perfectly normal tree. Echinibrium and bottom. What are you? Bissa uh, Lippervanica. Oh, hello. I'm gonna kill you. Cause I feel like it. Eh. Eh. Are you dead yet? Wait. 
You you seem like you're you seem tougher than the other ones. Uh oh. Oh no wait never no you don't. Okay I got to track. Okay that thing's rolling right there. All right fine. We're good we're good we're good. Die die die. I probably should if I'm gonna kill these things I should probably get an actual weapon. Okay where are you going? Don't uh, don't run away from me. Don't run away from me. There we go. Ooh damage radius cool. Okay now nah, I'm gonna get that later. There's probably another sentinel on the way. Where did there it is? Okay, neutrino module. I don't know what that does. I don't know why that is, but I have it. Okay, so let me send this stuff off to my ship. Neutrino module. Uh, man, I'm just out of space. How do I get more space? You know what? I don't need this. I'm gonna dismantle it. Because it, it's just gonna take up space, and I don't even know if it's gonna be something that I need. Okay. But that'll do for now. Ooh, what's that over there? E, I see it. I'm gonna get it. I'm gonna wreck it. Whatever it is, I'm gonna break it. I'm gonna destroy it. That's a language thing, isn't it? Knowledge stone. Yeah. Oh, cool. I mean, I guess maybe. I don't know. All right. So now, ah oh, man, I don't want to end the episode. Oh, I'll go for a little longer. Okay. So I'm gonna find out what this outpost is, and then I'm gonna, I'm gonna then I'm gonna end it. Then I'm gonna end it. Maybe. We'll we'll see about that. Find source of life signs. There's life signs over there. I'm gonna need to get more plutonium the next time I drop off because I'm not gonna have enough to be able to boost off of here. Ooh. Okay. Well, there's an outpost down there, but this outpost apparently have life signs. Okay. All right. Uh, land on the landing pad. Probably not. Oh. Nice! Killing it! And I'm gonna look at this! I'm gonna look at it real good! Yeah, that's a good look right there. You were, you were. Oh, I probably should have landed on this. Never mind, whatever. It's okay. It's alright! No one minds. Hello! Hi! What are you doing here? How can I help you? Okay? You are weird. Thank you. Warp. Creature awaiting me as the manner of a warrior, but makes no, makes no move to attack. Instead, it grunts in a tug I do not speak, then passes me a slate. With a start, I realize I can understand the text on it. In disbelief, I try to catch the creature's eye, but it is already turned away in disinterest. I suspect it is a mere courier, not the author of this message. The slate also contains a blueprint for a new technology, a hyperdrive. Well, handy that! That's exactly what I was looking for! Instructions on how to build my own path through the stars. This will be invaluable. The warrior thing... Nice. 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 Okay. Cool. I like that. I like that a lot. What are you looking at? Galactic Trade Terminal? What is that? Terminal sell items for your buy items. Ooh! Okay, oh, this is actually important. This ties into what I was gonna do anyway, which is... Okay, so these systems, I can rename and upload, or I can just upload it. So, I'm gonna rename this one. Oh, jeez, why do I have to do this? Uh, okay. Alright. Eh. Markiplier Land! Yeah! I'm not gonna bother renaming these because, good god, I, I, I can't even bother with that. But I've got a whole bunch of stuff over here. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna rename all the plants unless they're particularly phallic shaped. Because hot tits, that's gonna take forever. But on the other planet that I was on, which was I'm gonna rename the animals. Oh, you're dopey lopey. Oh, that's so that's definitely a dopey lopey. Okay. Dope uh, dopey. This is dopey lopey. Hi, Dopey Lopey. How you doing? Okay, screw these guys. Just upload them up. Yeah, upload them up. Oh no, no, no! I want to rename it. Oh man! Oh! I was gonna name that one Frumple Tail, but at least I'll name it. Oh! <laughs> He's so cute. Oh, what should I name him? Ah, oh, man. There's a profanity filter, so they can't be too bad. Oh, what should I name you? Oh. 
Cuddlewump. It's my little Cuddlewump. Oh, look at Cuddlewump go. Oh, what an adorable little horrifying monstrosity. But that's good, because now I have my discoveries uh, uploaded, and that gives me money. And when I have money, I, I believe I, I'm pretty sure I scan more than this. Yeah. Yeah, I knew I did. Okay, so there's more of this. But I'm just gonna upload these. I almost got all the animals on there. And by almost, I mean less than half. So not even close to almost. But that's cool. Okay. But anyway, I got those, so now I can buy stuff. So let's see what you got for sale. Buy. Ooh. Ah. Unstable plasma? That sounds good. Ooh, that's cool. That's cool! Oh, this is good, so I don't have to hunt down stuff, I can just- Oh, per piece, wow, that's a l- I don't have a lot of money. Okay, but this is for later! This is for later when I got the good stuff, but I don't have the good- I don't have a lot of money right now, but I'm gonna have a lot of money later, and I'm gonna go gather materials that are gonna be better to sell later on. What is this? Thank you! Free money? Okay, but I'm more interested in why this gun is right here. Clarity of Umagligblu? What? I, I want it. I, I want it. Oh! Oh, I want it! I don't have enough money! Oh, I want it! Oh! Is there more stuff I can sell? I, I have like the, uh, the Omicronian thing. Ooh, I can sell! I wanna sell! I want it! I want it so badly! <laughs> oh, man. I could sell that for a lot. I've got an extra- I got a lot of extra titanium. Ooh. Um. Oh, shit. Uh. Okay. Oh man, why can't I sell like my shielding shard or something? Okay, you know what? I'm gonna sell not not all of them. How do I how do I how do I sell a lot lower than all of them? I don't wanna sell all of them! I I shot up a lot of drones for this stuff. I'll sell 150. 149, good enough. Okay. And then plutonium. Oh, I don't have a lot of that. But I got a lot of heridium, and I know I know where to get heridium. And platinum is just from the things on the ground. How much do I have? Ah, not enough. Is that enough? Is that enough? I think that might be enough. That might be enough. Ooh, is that enough? Oh, I mean, it might have been 46,000, but I think it was... Ah, 48,600! God damn it! Uh, I want it! I want it! Take all of my stuff! I'll farm off screen! I want it! Take my money! I want it so badly! Oh, not, not the titanium, but the plutonium I can always get more of. Is that enough? Oh god, I'm gonna sell everything! Sell everything for this! Oh, oh, iron? Iron? Zinc! I haven't used zinc yet! I probably need it now! Oh, is that enough? Ah, oh, it's not enough! Take it all! Take it all! I don't care if my life support is about to go down! Oh, yeah! Okay, this is not worth it. This is probably definitely not worth it, but I want it. <laughs> I want it so bad. It's got more inventory, too! Yeah! I got it! I'm gonna use it! I got it! It's probably not a- it's probably not exciting. It's not exciting, is it? It's not- did I keep my, like, my bonuses? Yeah, okay, it, it kept them! And a plasma launcher! Ooh! Ooh! It comes with things! It comes- No analysis- WHAT?! I need an analysis visor! Why doesn't it have an analysis visor?! Oh, god damn it! I gotta build it! Well, okay. Well, there we go then. But that's fine. Oh, but I got it now. Prepare to be destroyed! Oh, yeah! I'm gonna assume that this is better. Even though I, I have no idea. I think it's got a higher cooling level thing. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah! Bam! Okay, so... That is the end of this episode of No Man's Sky. As you can see, I'm a big dumb idiot, and I have way too much fun with this sort of stuff. I- 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 I don't know why, but 
I love space. I love space so much. So in the, uh, in between this and the next episode, because I'm gonna do at least a few episodes of this. I don't know if I'm gonna do enough to ever get to the center of this universe, but I'm gonna do more of this. And man, I I, I just can't wait. It's gonna be so cool. It's gonna be so awesome. Like seriously, it's gonna be a fun time. So thank you everybody so much for watching, and thank you for everyone and the help you did to get me back home. I don't know what you did, but you know it helped. Hey, hey, guess what? You're, oh, you're getting fucked up now. Oh, oh, too bad for you. Oh, new technology. Nice. I don't know how to use the grenade launcher on this thing because apparently it does have a grenade launcher. Oh, hello. Whoa, wait. Hey. So thank you everybody so much for watching. This is going to be a fun one. And I can't wait to see more space stuff. And also, like, there's more cool games that are going to be coming out very soon. It's going to be awesome. So anyway, thank you everybody so much for watching. And as always, I will see you in the next video. Bye-bye!